Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Denny. If you're brand new, thank you for stopping in. If you're an oldie but goodie, welcome back. Today we have Sunday swatches and I am super sorry that I did not post two Sundays in a row. I have been super busy at the house just um, putting together my home salon. So I haven't been able to actually do Sunday swatches or videos in general. It really took all of my time. So with no further ado, today we will be swatching the Glam Light Cosmetics Ice Cream Dream Palette. And this looks way bigger than what it actually is. This is the PR package. No, I did not get this in PR. But yes, I did purchase it myself in the PR package because I like to put it back there as like memorabilia, right? So when you open it up, this is what the palette looks like itself and it's in here. So let's go ahead, take this guy out and I will show you what this beauty looks like. So this is the palette by itself and I believe it is available in just the palette without the actual PR packaging. I just think the truck is super cute. So this palette has 30 exquisite shades. It's actually what I have on today. And we have this palette which has mica and talc inside of it. Also, this has a shelf life of 18 months. It's cruelty uh, free and vegan. And I believe these do not have any carmine inside of it. So let's go ahead and open it up. Also, the sprinkles on the front, they move around. Is that not like the coolest? In any case, let me stop trying to mesmerize you. <laughs> uh, it does have a mirror which folds all the way back. And this right here is the stunning palette. It is beautiful. We're going to go row by row. Also, if you're interested in purchasing anything from Glanlight Cosmetics, I do have an affiliate code with them, which allows you to get 15% off. And that code is Gons Girl. And let's go ahead and get this started. So this is an ice cream theme palette. So everything in here is a ice cream flavor. To start with the first row, and I'm going to be using just these three fingers to do my swatches. I'm going to start with the color chocolate black cherry and red velvet those are the three shades and we're just gonna go straight down my arm not pressing too hard just enough for you to see and there you have it this one right here seems to be uh not as pigmented when you swatch but possibly might be pigmented when you go ahead and use a brush because it looks buildable the next two shades on that row are pumpkin and french vanilla oh french vanilla looks amazing so let's go ahead do that one there and this one here oh oh that is frosty and forgive my swatches if they look kind of crazy i have to use this <laughs> i just did this look that i have on but i didn't use any of the pink shades we're gonna go ahead on to the second row, which has butter pecan, salted caramel, and raspberry. And here we go with this one, this one, and this one. The pink seem to be a little bit more like you have to build them up, so buildable, but not really like pigmented with the swatch. I mean, you can still see it. Just those those uh, shimmers look super foiled and amazing. Then the next two shades are Rocky Road and Pecan Praline. Wow, those are beautiful. Gorgeous. I'm gonna go ahead and move on to the next row, which has Tarot. I love the flavor of taro, gelato, and cookie dough. I actually have cookie dough in my inner corner. Maybe you can see it, maybe you can't, but I will definitely have it swatched here so you will see it. Oh, that is gorgeous. That purple right here, <sighs> stunning. What was that, gelato? I need that in my life. <laughs> The next two shades on the third row are lemon and peanut butter. 
love peanut butter ice cream. That's like one of my favorite flavors. There you go. And we've reached my elbow. So I think we're gonna start swatching on the other arm. Beautiful. This is such a beautiful color scheme. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and start on the next row. And the first shade we have is strawberry. Then we have blueberry cheesecake. Then we have birthday cake, which is the green that I have on my lid right now. So let's do these in the right order. And those were the lightest like taps that I can do. <laughs> and it's still, I still have some on my fingers. And then the last two shades on that row are cotton candy and strawberry cheesecake. And I'm not sure why strawberry cheesecake looks golden, but I ain't mad at it. Wow, beautiful. So then the next row has the color mochi, honey lavender, and mint chocolate. And I actually have mint chocolate on my eyes as well. These feel very, very pastel and like pale. The green worked really well on my eyes. But on those uh, actual swatches, they really look really light. You can't even see them. But they're definitely buildable because it's what I have on my eyes. Then next I have Rainbow Sherbet, which looks gorgeous. And we have Orange Cream. Oh, I love some Orange Cream ice cream. It's so good. <laughs> now you're going to know my dirty little secrets that I love all ice cream flavors. <laughs> there you have those two. And I'm starting to like move kind of weird. And on to the last row, we have bubblegum. Not a fan of bubblegum ice cream. Pistachio, love pistachio. I love anything um, with nuts. For some reason, I don't think I swatched that correctly. And then Cookie Monster. I put Cookie Monster on my eyes today. So that's definitely up there. Can I see? I don't know. We have that one. One. And we have this one. <laughs> They're almost to my elbow. And then the last two shades, which are green tea, which also I have on my eyes, and mango. And now if I could just see where I last ended. I can't see all the way down my elbow. Well, there you have those, and they are just really beautiful no matter what the pigmentation is. I still am loving them on the eye with a brush. They perform a lot differently than with the swatches. So, here you have it. Here's the full palette. <laughs> I look crazy. <laughs> um, I really enjoyed using this palette on my eyes today. And I'll give you like a little close up so that you can see. I think it is very pretty. That green, what was it? Mint chocolate? No, birthday cake. Why did I think it was mint chocolate? I have no idea. Uh, the birthday cake one, it had like a feel of like, it felt like it was like a pressed glitter, but at the same time, a really soft foiled shadow. I don't know how to explain it. I've never felt anything like that one. That one has like a green with gold like speckle inside. It's just beautiful. I don't know how to explain most of these shades, especially like the shimmer shades. They're honestly, they're probably just like it says, exquisite. <laughs> so um, this right here retails can't remember how much it is I'll go ahead and put it down below so that you can know how much this palette is and if you enjoyed swatches with me I will be doing some more very shortly and hopefully I'll be back on my schedule if you enjoyed this please give it a thumbs up leave me a little ice cream emoji as well and go ahead and subscribe if you haven't done so already become a member of my guns fam and as always from my house to yours love ya